This is Tyler Bennett for AP Red Entertainment News. True Grit gallops into New York's Ziegfeld Theater when the stars line up on the red carpet this past Tuesday night for the Coen Brothers remake of the 1969 Western starring Jeff Bridges, Haley Steinfeld, and Matt Damon. Stars like Adrian Grenier, Padma Lakshmi, and Joe Pantoliano rushed in to catch the premiere while Jeff Haley and a few other surprises hung around to chat. But first, here's a glimpse of True Grit. Mr. Cogburn. In your four years as U.S. Marshal, how many men have you shot? Shot or killed? Let us restrict it to killed so that we may have a manageable figure. Mr. Cogburn? What do you want, girl? I'm looking for the man who killed my father. The man's name is Tom Cheney, and I need somebody to go after him. What's your name? My name is Maddie Ross. Are you some kind of law? I'm a Texas Ranger. I know Cheney. It is at least a two-man job taking him alive. Marshal Cogburn? Can we depart this afternoon? We? Oui. I'm going with you. Congratulations. You've graduated from Marauder to Wet Nurse. He's being followed. What do we do, Marshal? You missed your shot, Cogburn. Just let this go. I thought you were going to say the sun was in your eyes. That is to say, your eye. You got a lot of experience with bounty hunters, do you? That is a silly question. I am 14. You can run on for a long time. Time for you to go home. I don't like you. I will not go back, not without Cheney, dead or alive. Sooner later, gotta cut you down. Now what, Cogburn? Them boys don't think about the wrath that's about to set down on it. Check and this gang a rough lot. I do not regret shooting your father. I will kill this girl! Biggest mistake you ever made. God's gonna cut you down. Help me! I can do nothing for you, son. Donald Gleason, who stars as Bill Weasley in Harry Potter and in True Grit as Moon, gives props to newcomer Haley Steinfeld for her acting skills. Uh, it's not my place to give her advice. I mean, she's the lead in the movie and she seemed to be doing incredible, exceptional work. So it was not my place to offer advice and uh, it would have been misplaced and useless to her, I would imagine. TV actor Paul Ray, known for his roles on Fringe, Jonas and Memphis Beat, plays Emmett Quincy in True Grit and shares some thoughts on his frightening role. I was scared to death of the guy I played when I was a kid. <laughs> he frightened me. And, uh, and then when I got the movie, I. I went back and looked, looked it up, and I was like, yeah, that's the guy. But we uh, we had a blast doing it, and it was, a, it was a big honor for me. And Donald Gleason, who came through earlier, he's an Irish kid. We had a great time. We worked, we kind of worked together in the movie with Jeff. We were, like, we were like buddies, and we both were just in awe, sitting around watching all these big guys go at it. And never once did you see anybody in a hurry, N never, ever, like, agitated. They're like, they know what they're doing. Everything's planned out to the T. I got my sides, and there's storyboards for every side, pictures of everything, and I'd never seen that before. SNL's Bill Hader shares the cast of having Jeff Bridges on SNL during rehearsal. Oh, yeah. Just, yeah, all that. But Jeff Bridges, yeah, he's hosting this week. We met him yesterday. Everybody was crazy starstruck. He's like one of the, like, he really made everybody crazy starstruck. We're all just like, oh my God, that's Jeff Bridges. Yeah, we were just freaking out. I was, Literally writing with someone and then was like, oh, the premiere, I gotta go, and I'm gonna go right back there to, like, you know, continue, so we'll see. The ever-proud New Yorker and former mayor, Rudy Giuliani, still puts New York high on his pedestal. You know, I, I always called New York the capital of the world. I used to say, you know, Albany is the capital of New York's state, and Washington's the capital of the United States, but New York City's the capital of the world. And it really is. Jeff Bridges talks shop and tells us why he loves movies based on books and gives advice to young actors. Oh, well, you know, whenever you get to uh, make a movie based on a book, it's really a good thing because books are so much 
more fleshed out than the script. Scripts are really bare bones kind of thing, you know. And uh, this novel of Charles Portis is a wonderful read, filled with uh, you know, great characters. And it's kind of surprising, you know, that they're, not, that they're different than you expect them to be in the plot twists and all that. <laughs> True grit. <laughs> Seeing it through to the end, you know. Don't let those, uh, you know, the tough parts deter you from, from your goal, you know, hanging in. Haley Steinfeld, who AP Red is in love with, tells us what she loved about her character. Everything about it, really. I mean, I feel like, you know, off the, off the breakdown that I read about, I mean, two sentences, something about it. I mean, the role itself is so iconic, and, and just there's so much more to her than a lot of people see. And, and I just feel like, you know, reading more about her, reading the, reading the script, having the book, it just gave me so much information that, you know, what it was I fell in love with. All in all, True Grit may have gotten snubbed for Golden Globe noms, but it's sure to be an audience favorite this holiday movie season. Stay tuned for more red carpet coverage on APRed.com.